Oh my goodness gracious, there are five baby goats. Alrighty, I just looked out the window and thought I saw Tansy licking something. And we've got a baby. Tansy has babies. All right, so, um, she has a baby. Can we get to the baby's face? All right, let's grab Foxy out of the way. Okay, I'm gonna come in here and say hi. It's so cute. Good job, mama. Uh, I think so. Um, I think it's a boy because I can't see very well. She's doing great. I'm just gonna let mama keep going. Actually, I'm gonna pull, sorry, back up. I'm gonna pull baby over here. Good job, mama. All right, is that a boy? Yes, it is. Yes, definitely a little buckling. Come here, mama. Oh, what a cutie. Oh, oh, okay, you're dumb. All right, we're gonna pause the video because we're gonna move this mama. All right, so a little bit of logistics. We, um, Cedar looks like she might be close. I don't know if she's in labor, but she totally could be. And Tansy has one little baby boy. And so these three little girls, Esther, you got one? Gentle. So these three little girls are nice and fluffy and starting to be bouncy. So we got all the mamas and babies over here. Um, we're gonna let Tansy be in there. And uh, we're just playing and uh, keeping an eye on everybody. Uh, she's, pro she's probably got more, but we moved her. So um, we did get them out of here. Everybody was just being nosy. Um, it's a lot easier to have goats in their own space. Nobody was doing anything hurting them, but I know the boys kind of walked by and they practically stepped on the baby because they're boys and they don't care. So uh, we've got Tansy in here. We're gonna kind of chill and we got Cedar in here in case she goes into labor too. And I think we'll just leave all these goats in here together. So I gave birth on Saturday and today is Monday. So closer than I was expecting. Oh, she always has the cutest little boys. But hopefully we get some some dolings out of her too. Good job, mama. Yeah, I'm starting to stand up and Hey Ivy, go away. You don't need your baby. <laughs> this little guy's bushes, he's he seems much bigger than Ivy's little girls. Yeah, that's Oh, good job, Mama. <laughs> you can nurse while she's laying down. Are you pushing her baby out? Um. Mom, can I come in? If you stay like right here, sit on the ledge. But I can't see. I um. Then you can maybe go out and go around where Cole is. That might be better. Yep, so the kids can watch from out here. She's having another one. You can tell them. Oh, yep. Good job, Mama. She's doing great. Oh. Yeah, it's breach. What's up with everybody having breech babies? So, I'm going to give Mom just a second. Yep, stand up, Mama. Come on. Was it breach? Yep, it was breach. Okay, but out right away. Oh, there's another one coming already. <laughs> okay. Oh, goodness. All right, let me get your head, sweetie. Let me get that. Yep, yep. That's kind of cool. I do want to... Come on, Caleb. There's three ba There's two babies already, and there's a third one coming out. Wait, really? Yeah. Wow, fast. Come here, baby. Okay. All right, I'm gonna let it is still attached, so I'm just gonna let mama. I'm just gonna let mama go. Oh, oh, the other one is literally coming out. <laughs> That's okay. That's okay. 
it's okay. I guess Oprah Shh. Is good job, Mama. Yeah, I'm not sure. So, all right, let me. Yeah, yep, I'll come. I think it was breach. There it is. Um, I think it's really hard to tell. That would be crazy town. I know. It is hard to hold a camera and wipe. All right, we're moving you. Mama, Mama, I hear. Can't I know. I'm hearing that there. So I really need somebody to come grab a camera, and I need somebody to grab me the. Dead. No, 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 no. Nobody's dead. Everybody's good. If you would hold this. Cole, run to the birth box and grab There's that. The birth box. I need that um, new blue. Sucker new thing. Head. It's the the thing I have to put my mouth on to do it. Hurry. It's Cole, can you keep Ivy out of here? Oh, here, Four baby gets. Here. Cedar's in here. And Ivy. They're both trying to break in. You can't hurt the baby goats. They're not going to hurt the baby Mom, there's a fourth. Yep, there's a fourth. And Thank it's you. not breach. Thank you. And it's a lot. Of course it's not they're not supposed to be these. Okay, good. Yeah, second. Alright. Yeah. There's adorable baby goats over here trying to get into. Okay, this one. <laughs> is it coming face first? Okay, so that one's good. We're good. She's pushing again. Yeah. Oh, it's a big one. <laughs> I don't even know if these are girls yet. She's oh, it's, oh, it's brown. Oh, they're all going to be boys. Four boys and three girls. They all look like they have gopher ears. Yeah, because Oak does. <gasps> They're all gopher ears. Woo! This one's out. Yes, yes. Do it. Uh, this one's out. There we go. It might be a dome. Appreciate the dome. She oh, still looks awfully great. big. Yeah, she might have five. That would be fun if she had five. Because you're up and crawling around. It's been like two minutes. That's oh. a boy. That was a boy. The okay. first and fourth are boys. Let me check this. And the two, two middles are girls. The middles are girls. I thought it's one. There could be another one. Wait, no. it looks like they can to watch and film at the same time. All right, so the little boy, oh, Eve is just on. She's working on her placenta. I'm gonna go get her some pain meds. But the little boy was nursing while he was laying down. I thought that was cute. I think I just barely got it on camera. But Tansy's doing awesome. So I'm gonna go get her. Uh, we use an afterbirth tincture and a pain tincture just to help make sure she is doing all right. 
We got her a little bowl of alfalfa with some wormer powder and some molasses in it. And uh, we're gonna keep watching. Here's the baby. Choose another one. Has fries. He has fries. Baby. baby. I told you I saw something black. Yeah, baby. no, I I know. I didn't believe baby, you because it looked baby. like her placenta was coming. <laughs> oh my goodness, Tansy. Oh my Is goodness. She have six? Colby. Oh, please no. We're probably gonna have to like bottle feed. <laughs> she has eight. That's no, 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 no. The new world record. No. Whew, the tarp There's on this thing. Five baby goats. There's another baby goat coming. Um, ooh, I'm gonna need a. I can't. I don't. So hold on, to Ellie. This. If you could grab the cup behind you, I and can't. if you could get out of the thing and go put the stuff in the birth box, okay. and then bring me a towel. Bring I think the mic's towel. fine. Not worried about that. Just video is fine. Are you worried at all that it might not be alive? No. No, they're all four. The other ones are perfect. Yeah. It's only been a couple minutes. Oh, yeah. Oh. Yeah, it's it's Switch babies. That's kind of downhill here. She's having a hard time. Yep, I know. Mama's working hard. We're gonna get you guys squared away over there. Hi, Good job, Mama. She's a, that's Thank a you. tiny baby. Uh, I don't know about tiny. The bummer is I just moved the thing to get rid of all the fluids. I had no idea. Yeah. It's pretty crazy town. Hive. Oh my goodness. Well, the buckling's gonna have to be a bottle baby immediately. That would be a new already one. have eight. eight. <laughs> I can't believe she's having five. We already have eight. Baby I did not in oh. any world think that five was ever going to actually happen. Um, we probably are gonna end up with like forty up here. Oh my goodness. Yeah. Oh. Oh. She's, she's alright. Oh. Yeah. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Oh, baby. Nick. Yeah, it's okay. She's just. Oh, this is the little boy, man. He is up and raring to go. Oh, he's going to get all wet. Yes, he is. Oh. That's alright. She's doing great. She's doing a great job. I wonder why she wasn't eat, eating her little uh, snack. She's eating it. She is now. Yeah, but normally they go crazy for it. That's because she's got another one. Peter, just hanging in there. Do you want to try to Imagine get out? if he had six. No. Oh. Is baby coming? Yes. Yeah. We're working on it. There we go. Is she, is she <laughs> <laughs> Not enough. It was head first. I saw the head. No, Peter. Oh, my goodness gracious. <laughs> yep. Yeah, that's its placenta. That's her placenta. Uh, no, not... I mean... Good job, little Please one. Say You're a big nozzle? baby. I it's put away for the moment, but I'll get it. Yes, please. There you go, mama. Wow. Oh, that wind. It's very windy. Oh boy. That's a boy. No. Oh my goodness, the wind. That has a skinny neck. Yeah. Yep. Mama, oh, thank you. Two dolings. That's crazy. So we're gonna have to pull two bucklings right away. Probably the feistiest two in bottle feet. Like I mean, probably tomorrow. No. Yes. Oh my goodness gracious! There are five baby goats. I don't. I don't even know what to do with five baby goats. I. <laughs> Tansy has had three, uh, two years in a row. And uh, this year she just went straight to five. We were joking about Ivy having five because she's had two and three and four, uh, but she just had three. So now we have five, three bucklings and two dolings. Uh, so we're definitely gonna pull some of those bucklings, probably two of them to be bottle babies. <laughs> they are so cute and Tansy's doing awesome, but oh my goodness gracious. So now our job is to make sure that they all get some milk and that everybody is good to go, but everybody looks great and Tansy's doing great too.
It's the next morning. I am down here to check on Tansy's quintuplets. I was trying to do some research and figure out how common that is. I saw one article repeated over and over that it was one in 10,000. But I saw another farm, a thrifty homesteader. She is an awesome goat resource if you're looking for stuff. She said she's had up to eight sets of quintuplets on her farm over the years. So it's not that rare, but it is kind of crazy to have five babies at the same time. Uh, I am definitely going to need to bottle feed some of these kids. So I'm just trying to be really careful about making sure that they get enough colostrum from mama making sure that they are all getting some and then if I can make it to day three if Tansy can hold out uh, yesterday I was making sure she had colostrum in her teats every time a kid tried to nurse so she did uh, we'll see how that plays out today um, but if I can make it to day three then I can only have to bottle feed four times a day and not in the middle of the night so that is what we're going for but let me show you these cuties and uh, check in on Tansy and her babies. The babies are so cute. Look at them. Little pile of babies. There's one back there by mama. So this is River with Tansy's babies. We're getting everybody moved to clean ground. It's amazing how much poop they poop. So uh, River, she's getting a little excited. She does really well. But I'm just, hey, shh. It's cute, the little babies try to like go under her. So I want her to sniff, but I don't want her to be overly excited or overly licky or anything like that. Oh, good. Hi, little babies. Look at you cuties. It's okay, she didn't mean to. The babies are fine. Alright. So I just finished weighing them all. I have this cool little scale and this sling from Premier One. The scale is just from Amazon. And this allowed me to take their weights. The two bucklings are the biggest. Uh, and then the third buckling t is about the same size. The, the two dolings and the smaller buckling are very, very close to each other in size. Mama's doing great. We got everybody moved. So this John Siskovich tractor is on fresh ground. Again, this thing has been such a blessing. It's a nice big space that's weather protected and then uh, we just moved Ivy and the babies in here uh, Cedar was in here because Cedar is due any day um, but Ivy and Cedar don't always get along so we're um, I don't know if Cedar's just roaming around right now the kids are out here with me or if Cedar oh there she is she's in the far pen so we'll just keep our eye on her and when she starts to kid we'll move her back over they're really good with each other the moms when they have babies um, but when they don't, sometimes they're just annoyed. So anyway, we got them moved over. Now obviously we have to finish getting Ivy some shelter and some water. And Miss Tansy is constantly looking to get out of here. Um, but this is the best place to make sure that the babies can all get to her and get some milk. Kind of forces her to be patient. She is doing a great job. We just, um, Cole and I, made sure that every baby got some milk. I'm continually testing her teat to make sure there's still milk in there, and there is. So it's definitely still colostrum at this point. She's doing awesome. All the babies I now have a weight on, and I know they just got some milk. So um, it will be easy to keep track of. Hey, girl, you have to stay in here. I'm going to shut the door on you. Whew. But yeah, so this is just kind of part of the process. This is the next day. She gave birth around 1.30, 2 ish and uh, it's this morning maybe 9 or 10 I'm not actually sure what time it is and uh, the babies are looking happy oh oh they're starting to fall asleep and I'm gonna get my scale out of here just clipped it on again Johnson Scovis tractor for the win and I'm gonna go ahead and close Tansy in good girl 
um, and I'll put a carabiner on there. She's got plenty of space. She's got hay up out of the way. We've got water up out of the way so the baby goats can't get into the water. And we've got some adorable baby goats. 